What's up guys? Today we are in some random canal in West Palm, Florida. And today we're fishing with my dad, Aaron, Jack, and we're all going after these new exotic fish that we haven't caught before so that we can knock it off our bucket list. Hey, 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 hey. This canal houses some pretty special fish. We've got peacock bass and clown knife fish, and we are with pretty much the best person to go out with right now. Today we are out with Brian from Push In Water Kayaks, and he specializes in both offshore kayak fishing and inshore clown knife fish, peacock bass, largemouth bass fishing. So the rig is really simple. We've got a light line, little split shot, little hook, and a live shiner. This is a very similar way that I caught a snook just yesterday. Light line, live bait, little split shot. But this time we're fishing in freshwater. But I think the same principles will apply. Let's get going. Hands free. Way better than kayak, huh? This you can do. This you can do. Well, out here, we're generally using live shiners. <laughs> the main food source out here is there's a lot of shad in this, in this waterway. So instead of trying to cast net shad and whatnot, we just go buy some shiners so we can get out here quick and have plenty of bait. Um, you can use, a, I use a number two or number four. This one's a little bigger because we got a little bigger baits today. But we're just a little live bait hook, just right through the, from the bottom to the top. The key is really, you want a frisky bait. Um, as you guys have seen, a lot, lively one is much gonna be, get a lot more action than uh, one that's just even, even still alive, but just slowly swimming. They want a nice fresh one, nice and frisky. And that's gonna get to your bite. Brendan, are you excited to fish I'm excited, right I want to give it a try. Still not try fun. to put your rods up down a little bit so the wind doesn't catch your line so much and you can kind of see it better. See what he's doing. He might have one on, he's swimming at you. Yeah, reel down, you might have him. Feel weight to the hook. Oh, <laughs> you feel I weight? feel weight, I feel okay. weight, yeah. <laughs> They'll do that a lot too. They'll just come straight towards you. Not, you don't know you got them. I guarantee you throw a cast like that with a fresh one, he's gonna get a smack immediately. You're on. You're on. There you go. Good one. Good one. There we go. Should be good. Look like it. I keep forgetting to get the lighter rod. Watch <laughs> this be a large rod. Bass. That's a few more. Oh. Small one again there. There we go. Wow, look at the color on this fish. Yeah. Cool spots on them. Oh, this one's pretty caught before, too. Oh, yeah. They're all gonna have holes in their lips. Did you, caught, you catch lips. mine? Huh? <laughs> pretty. There we go. A little bit better. A little bigger. Oh yeah. That's a little better. Yeah. Good boil. Get away from the boats. Isn't that good? Yeah, there's a decent one. That's a problem. Nice. Swing them this way. There, there we go. go. <laughs> That's a proper one. <laughs> wow, look at the shit. Wow. Look at that. Yeah. No, so that's the like chair. the average size you get in here. Average? Yeah. So there's this isn't the boss yet, huh? Yeah, there no, nah, yeah, there's there's bigger ones. <laughs> How does it feel? It felt that was a strong one. They're they're very really feisty, they have a lot of head shakes. I had one fish, the shiner fell off, another fish came and ate that shiner. They're pretty aggressive and the shiner seemed to be the way the, the, the ticket right here. That was nice. Too 
keep them away from the boats. Try to keep them to your side there. Oh, that's a nicer one, Aaron. Oh yeah, really nice one. Nice one. Really? Wow. Nice one, Jack. Look, Jack's got a largemouth bass. Aaron's got a peacock bass. Nice job. Pictures all around. It's feisty. It's a bass. Oh, it's a peacock. Tiny one. <laughs> Tiny one. Peacock. I forgot you got the lightest rod. It looks bigger. <laughs> they don't have teeth, do they? Uh, just like a normal bass. Okay. Oh, nice. All right. Let's let this guy go. Small and feisty. You're out of bait? Why don't you just use his rod? No, the same thing. I just, I just set the big fish in there. Oh, lost it. Yeah. Just now. Huh? Just now you lost the fish? Yeah. See, that's not, not the same one. Peacock. Oh, it's just a large mouth. This is after that's a large one. Huh? After that it's not, it's not, it's a different one. Large mouth bass, but that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for peacocks and clownfish. Yeah. That's a crazy looking fish.
Nice landed. Yes. Woo. That was a crazy fight. Woo. Wow. Whoa, dude, this is a crazy fish. What the heck? I never thought I'd be holding one of these fish. Hey, thanks for putting us on. Yeah, it took us a while. Finally got on the bike. Just a little bit. We found one, and that's awesome. Oh. So we knocked off two, two species off my buckets list. A nice big peacock bass and is this an average size what, what's, what yeah, size is this? Average. average size clown knife fish wow. wow look at the spots on that Woo. you can hold them straight up too you can see his tail like kind of like snake like hold them just yeah like that. Oh, just like Lots this wiggle. Mm -hmm. Whoa. all right we're gonna let this guy go how was your wow. day we got some pretty nice bucket list fish. Aaron, you got a nice donkey of a, a peacock bass. Yeah. And I got a crazy knife fish. That was, I never thought I'd be touching one of those. I never thought I'd ever catch one of them actually. So, dream come true. Thank you, Brian, for putting us on some fish. I mean, this is the experience to do it with. On a Hobie, with some nice reels. I've got a Stratic 3000 here and a G Loomis rod, 15 pound line. If you like our show, please like and subscribe. We do an episode every single Thursday. If you really like our show, press the little bell button next to the subscribe button so that you'll be notified every time we put out a new episode. Our job here at Hay Skipper is to help as many people get on fish as possible. We want to make learning how to fish easy. We've got a ton of tutorials, a ton of crash courses, as well as a ton of our specialized bait. Visit us at hayskipperfishing.com for more info. All right, guys, see you next week.